Well, the topic of racism has come up in the federal election campaign, but are the real issues behind discrimination actually on the political agenda? CBC's Mike Crawley takes a closer look. Hello, how are, how are you? Good to see you. Some of the biggest moments in this election campaign have touched on racism. You should cut your turban off and you, put a, you look like a Canadian. He can't even remember how many times he put blackface on. Yet neither Justin Trudeau's repeated use of blackface, nor Jagmeet Singh making history as the first person of color to lead a major national party, nor Maxime Bernier's stance on immigration has prompted a deeper look at how racism affects people's lives. I have to say that I'm very disappointed the issue around racial justice, racial uh, equity has not been addressed by any party in any uh, substantive way. Why didn't that happen? AV Go thinks it's because people don't like to talk about the realities of racism. Conversation about race is often difficult uh, in Canada. I think that a lot of Canadians uh, still don't uh, still are not able to come to grabs with the idea that um, there is a, a lot of racism within our country. In a pre-election nationwide survey of Muslims, nearly 8 in 10 respondents named Islamophobia as an important issue. I feel like this, was an oppor this election was an opportunity for uh, our party leaders and, and, the, and, and from all parties to, um, to address this, and I don't think that it's been done um, in a way that is satisfactory. Ali Manik also criticizes the party leaders for not taking what he calls a strong stance against Quebec's ban on religious symbols in the public service. I think that all parties have let down uh, the Muslim community and ethnic communities tremendously um, in, uh, by not addressing it um, more head-on. Activists also question why the parties aren't doing more to tackle higher rates of poverty and incarceration among some racial minorities. These are situations that people are dealing with on a day-to-day -day basis. And I, I feel like, unfortunately, this campaign has failed to address most of them because we're a lot more interested in spectacle, we're a lot more interested in public embarrassment than we are actually interested in what is meaningful to Canadians of colour. It's a paradox, especially since some of the tightest battleground ridings in this election are among the most ethnically diverse in the country.